everyone today the question is how do you do a screenshot in windows 10 so this is actually very easy so in windows 10 it has been made easier through the windows snip so uh, all you have to do is to press windows shift and then s and your screen will darken a little bit and then we will see three tools here this is the rectangular snip this is the freeform snip this is the window snip this is the full screen snip and this is cancel so let's start with the rectangular snip so the purpose of the rectangular snip is that you can choose a portion so you can drag hold the left mouse button in the portion that you want and then hold it left click and then going down and then unhold the left click button and then uh, usually in the left side here in the left side there will appear a a, a pop-up so if you can't see it all you have to do is to click this part here this one just click that one there's a notification so let's click on it and then see so we have here a snip saved in our clipboard so this is the snip and sketch app in windows 10 so all we have to do is to click on that and then we can now have the option to save this snip or this screenshot so we can uh, there's a save option here if you try to see there's a uh, this button here so all you have to do if you want to save that is to click on that and then you'll be asked where to save so this is the usual uh, you know dialogue between you and the computer save so you can rename it so let's say for example let's name it google picture uh, google front page or home page front home page and then let's save it and if you go to your my pictures uh, you will see that it's already there see okay so that's how you can use the rectangular snip so what if you want to use the free form so the free form let's say for example we have a bird let's have a bird and let's try to search for images of birds so how about if we want to remove the background only a small portion of the bird the outline of a bird so we can use the other one the freeform snip if you like okay so actually we cannot have it perfectly good without the background but at least we can remove a little bit of its background so again what do we do we use windows shift and then the letter s uh, please be aware that you need to hold both the three not both but the three buttons all together okay so this time let's do the freeform snip let's click on that and then we will try to outline the bird okay at least remove a little bit of its background and then there right so usually there's a pop-up menu here but i disabled it because i find it annoying but if you can see a pop-up here just have to click here again remember this part and then click on that and then you see here your snippet sketch all right so it's without a little bit of the background and all you have to do you can zoom if you like all right then uh, our intent here you can also write here uh, there are many tools here but one we want to save this one so we can click on save as then we have here the dialog box again so we call it bird with a little background so let's save so if you go to your my pictures you will see there uh, where's my picture here it's already here so you can use this one for your uh, worksheets or anything you would like. All right, so let's proceed now to the next one. Uh, again, let's use the Windows, Shift, and then S, hold them all together. And let's try this Windows Nick. So if from the word window, so all these are windows here we have firefox window we have the powerpoint window we have the uh, window snip uh, uh, window so all you have to do is to click on that and then 
the whole window here will be copied. Alright, so you can just click the window that you want to be snipped. Okay, so uh, we've already uh, hit on Firefox. So if we go here again, in this part, we click on that. We see the whole window was screenshot. All right. So that's all you have to know. You no, know, the whole Firefox window was uh, was captured. So again, you just click on Save As here in the disk button, and then call this Firefox window. Right, and then hit on save and again if you go to your pictures you will see there your uh, uh, you will see there the picture of the screenshot of the Firefox window hey okay. right. so you can do this in Facebook or any Facebook post they want to uh, screenshot right so you know, this is very helpful all right so let's do another one again the last one again let's hold uh, windows shift and then s so this time let's go to the full screen snip so whatever screen you have all the screen that you have here will be taken so if you click on that see it took a picture of your screen so if you go to again this part let's click on that you hear the snip and sketch all right so it's already here the whole window including the desktop part uh, no, everything in the window was taken. So uh, that's how you do your screenshot in Windows 10. It has been done. That has been made easier. And I hope this helps. So thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. And if this helped you, don't forget to help others too by sharing this. And don't forget to please uh, you know, hit the like button and promote this channel so that we'll be able to help more teachers to be more techie. Alright, so thank you so much for listening. God bless everyone.